You got a, like a sore muscle? Yeah, it's like under my shoulder blade. Mm, it's where I store my hype. It's like when I breathe in deep, it hurts. Mm -hmm. One of those Carmen gets them there. Mm. Like, ah, you do me too, the way you slept. Do me too? Yeah. Yeah. Same spot? Yeah. You don't even have a pain. Oh. You made it up. Hey guys, Wave Squadron reporting in. I'm Eric. I'm Calvin. Oh, I feel better. Okay. Is this how we're starting this? What are we doing? We're outlaws. I mean, Star Wars outlaws. We're not outlaws. We're playing outlaws. Oh, the game. Yeah, the official About story the trailer for Star Wars Outlaws, which we had a premiere uh, a while back, I believe, that we reacted to. Yeah. yeah some gameplay. Which didn't, uh, I don't remember too much about it, except for a not so lot. I remember a commando droid in a trench coat. Was this the, coat. was this the, like, the four characters? No, this seemed like a one girl with an axolotl who was like running from the law like it Theft Auto. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah! But we should hopefully find out Whoa. from this maybe a little bit more of what exactly it's about. Each of you hmm. represents some of the most powerful criminal organizations in the galaxy. Yeah, underworld? Pikes, yeah. Crimson Dawn, mm -hmm. Huts. It's a golden age for the underworld. The Empire controls every corner of the galaxy, but they're distracted by a rebellion that won't quit. It's an opportunity to make millions. Cool blast, hey, right? Vex. The underworld's favorite new scoundrel. Wow. We need it last. What do you want? Zarek Besh. They're new, rich, and lethal. Zarek Besh. Okay. You crossed their boss, Sliro. And now, he wants you gone. Sliro. Rob his fortune, buy your freedom. This job, it's a death wish. Whoa! Huh. I'm in. So she visited the palace while he was frozen? I buy like your reputation. Wow. You want to survive? Know the players. You're new in this world. It's your problem. Come back when you're not. Come back when you're not into this world. Right? Oh. Don't try anything. I got a whole crew surrounding this king with something to I don't know. For about as long as I can remember, it's just been me and Nyx. Nyx? You brought gun? Doing what we have to to survive. Yes. Delph. This job is my one shot at freedom. It's like a scrambler. Spear. But if we're gonna pull this off, we huh. need the right crew. That was good. And the right ship. It's a piece of junk. Yes. Come on. I can't believe because you were one of the best hunters in the outer rim. <laughs> She's more connected than you let on, Sleero. Right, right. Bess is mixed up in something bigger. Ah! Hold on! The rim is a dangerous place. Ugh. Everyone is fighting for their piece Close of the line. galaxy. Yeah. But all I want is to live free. So I'm gonna risk it all. Hold on, Dick! Oh no! That's a Sarlacc! Those spiders. Great, the great dragon. dragon. That was a great dragon. That was. That robot was with her in that image. Yeah, I think he's like a companion or something. Campaign. He was in the first. Campaign. Campaign. A companion. Cool. A companion with the campaign. That's yes. what that means. No, I mean it, it's a neat like commando droid neat. being being like altered. You know, maybe he was. Remember the droids in uh, Rebels? They kind of like made their own choices, right? Ooh. He got shot. I mean, they were just following the last orders they had, which is finished. Yeah, but then they decided to not. Yeah. And then they went on somewhere. Yeah. Kalani. Kalani. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, I don't know. It could be kind of cool to see what happens with that guy. I mean, yeah, he has to be somehow disconnected from the CIS network whenever Anakin shut them all down in episode three. I mean, just like those ones were. Exactly. They were disconnected. Yeah. So, some, somehow that happens as well. <clears throat> yes. Um, but yeah, I, I personally for me, I just liked all the different various locations. All the good. At one point, I thought it looked like Kajimi. Like they had the uh, the roofs with the almost kind of like the tiles. Yeah, like the tile but roof. it was specifically like an Asian look to the roofs right there, which reminds me of Kajimi from Episode Nine. Uh, you know where Poe goes with Zori Bliss and stuff. Pogo. Pogo. Yes. Um, 
I'm maybe. I'm guessing maybe that's it. But I usually and, see that at night, so I don't know what it looks it like. It also looked like they go to a few places because uh -huh. you have the uh, the cartels, yeah. and it looks like you're going, like, you must go to Tatooine. Mm -hmm. um, there's a point she's sliding to the Sarlacc, she looks at Han and Carbonite, you know, mm -hmm. like all those kind of things. She you meets know. Jabba. Solo, Solo movie talks about five cartel families, but the one here that they mentioned is new. I hadn't heard it before. Kesh. Yeah. Like, if this were just... A freeze frame of a movie, I would believe ah. that she's in the movies. It just looks so good. All the background with Jabba yeah. and his yeah. palace background. The palace, the lighting and everything, it's so clean and good. Yeah. But, like, as far as story goes, like, you're in, you know, you, like, with Han Bean and Carbonite, you're <coughs> between episodes uh, five and six. Mm -hmm. So that's where we are as far as, like, Empire is in reign, the Rebellion mm -hmm. is doing attacks and stuff. Like, yeah. Oh, cool. Spare ion engine racks. Yeah. <laughs> that's neat. The solar flows. Yeah, that's really cool. It definitely seems like it's going to be a lot more emphasis in um, exploration slash stealth as opposed to maybe like, you know, just straight up blaster fire, that type of thing. So Yeah, I it feels that, kind that of uncharted-y yeah, in, in that way. Mm -hmm. I really think it's going to be Grand Theft Auto-like, which yeah. in, in those, like, you can traverse around... You can do stealthy missions. You can go blasting. Like, it gives you some freedom for what you want to do, which I think would be really cool to let you explore cities and stuff. But it might not, and I don't want to get my hopes up of, like, a lot of exploration. Sure. Um, Jedi Survivor had quite a bit of exploration on at least one planet. Mm -hmm. The other ones were a little more linear, but you still kind of could explore them some. I'd like to be able to fly my ship in sure. one of these games one day. And, there was and what I mean by that is being able to just take off and fly around and sit down wherever I want. Sure. That would be I really guarantee cool. you it doesn't happen. That's this game. illegal. Guarantee it doesn't happen. It's illegal, Eric. Why? You can't just land your ship anywhere on the planet. Sure you can. You can't. I mean, you can't, like, on someone's house, can but you, you can in a desert. Can you just park your car you... anywhere you want to park your car? In a, at a highway? Yeah, generally. Just anywhere. Like, there's always medians. Well, highway space, Eric. Mm -hmm. Sure, Aaron, but there's planets that are deserted. Sometimes there's places that are deserted. I'm you just can saying, fly there. when you get to where you arrive, uh -huh. can you just park anywhere you want? Or their designated parking places. I can't. I am stuck on the ground. Yeah, that's what I'm <laughs> I saying. can't get there. No, but I would like. I was just a fantasy of mine to one day the grass. be able to fly a Star Wars designated. ship like it's meant to. But it's generally they, you know, it's it's a cutscene and then you're just you're on, on the, the planet. Yeah. yeah. I just wish we could break that one day. I mean, they did with. Uh, oh shoot! What was that game called? I played on the Switch and it had Star Fox in it. Um, I can't know what it's called, but like you can just leave orbit, fly away, head to other planets, come down. Starforge. Star. Starfield is Starlink. Starlink. That's Starlink. It. But no, I mean in the in the world of Star Wars, like I would attribute highways to being space and like the hyperlanes and that kind of stuff. But like when you get to my house, you're not allowed to just park on my grass. That's wherever, true. Wherever you want, you have to park in my driveway. That's or true. otherwise, I might get mad and make you move. Yeah. I feel like it's the same thing. If you just go land anywhere you want, you might get in trouble. Then let me get in trouble because I landed in the wrong spot. That sounds fun. Sure. That's that's <laughs> that's the Grand Theft Auto part that I'm yeah. looking for. That's yeah. what I'm talking I just, about. However, I, 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 I'm, however, I'm jumping point, on your fantasy. That would be great. I just do not see it happening. However, at that point, you may lose your vehicle and now you're stuck on your planet. And now it may be more of a hindrance to the game's flow. So sure, you might have to like they may pay not, a fine to they may not want get you to your do vehicle that, back. You know? But they may have designated locations where you're like, I can probably land here and here and here. Like you sometimes go to a planet and you'll land like down here in these cliffs where no one's really gonna be, but maybe a bounty hunter's gonna come and get your get your stuff. Is this a Wookiee? Mm, I think it's just that guy's coat. It does look a lot like that guy's furry coat. But it's here. That's that no, guy. It was I think it's there. over his shoulder. Huh? I think yeah, it's no, over you, that guy's shoulder. Yeah, it's over that guy's shoulder. He has a furry coat. It's over his right shoulder looking at the that guy. The and then when you cut the other one, you're seeing the other way. So you're not seeing all that on the side there. It still could be Wookiee, though. I think it's his. It's that. No, it's that, Calvin. Yeah, that's it's what it clearly is. that. That could be a Wookiee pelt is what I'm saying. Oh, that's not a Wookiee. How do you know? It would be cool if Black Chrysanthemum could show up or something. Mm -hmm. At first, I couldn't remember what the timeline was for it. And they're like, ah, oh, the Empire's and doing this we have syndicates I was like dude where's Maul that was where my thoughts went to and then there's like Han Solo's and Carbon I'm like okay mm -hmm. yeah. so now I kind of have a better idea of where we're going to be but no I mean I want to see more of the gameplay aspect and not just not just 
them either fighting or stealthily moving through locations, I want to see, like, is there a lot of exploration? Like, can we, can we go through the city? That one guy was like, get out of here. You're new to this world. Come back when you're not. Yeah. Which makes me think of, like, well, now you can explore this world, do quests, help people, do whatever you got to do to make a name for yourself so that you can come back and now this guy will listen to you or work for you or work with you or whatever you got to do. Yeah. Like, you have to get your, your underworld... Your cred. You gotta get your, your cred, cred down. There's no street cred. No, you, you still get street cred. It goes up. Your credibility yeah, it goes, up. goes down. No, it goes up. Your, your street cred goes up, Calvin. Your street cred goes this up. This is why you don't have street cred, Calvin. credibility Calvin. goes down. Guys, thank you so much for watching this trailer reaction to Star Wars Outlaws. Make sure you're following us here because this is where we'll stream the game. Right here on YouTube. You can also check us out at Twitch because we'll also do it there too. Two places, two streams. Uh, we do that for a lot of things, so if you just want to catch everything, twitch.tv slash is a good place.